Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The picture shown on screen is the initial screen view when you open up Word 2000. The first thing you should notice is that the Word window consists of two separate windows. There's the application window and the document window. The document window, where we actually create our document, opens up within the application window. You can close the document window, using the small x in the upper right corner, without closing the whole Word application. So you can see the application window right now is displayed on screen. And having multiple documents open up within the application allows you to work with multiple different memos, faxes, letters, without having to restart the program. The application window is the actual outer frame of the program. It consists of the title bar up at the top, the menu bar in which we can click commands and then select subcommands from the menus that appear, the status bar down at the bottom telling us information about our document such as what page we're on, the standard toolbar which contains standard commands used across the entire Microsoft Office suite like new document, open document, save document, spell check. Below that we also have the formatting toolbar which is what we use to make our documents look better. So we've got font, bold, italic, underline, and then of course the document area. Now depending on your document view, which we'll discuss the views of a document in a little bit, you'll also have a ruler and maybe a tab button in the upper left corner. Also, you'll probably have a scroll bar at the right side of your screen, which you can use to scroll up and down through the document by either pressing the arrows or clicking and dragging on the little box in the bar. And you may also have one at the bottom of your document. And so these are the different objects, and we're going to discuss them a little bit in the next few lessons. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.